Thanks to Marielle, new at six, D.C.'s City Council has approved its 2024 fiscal year budget. Our political and government reporter Leonard N. Fleming is joining us live. Uh, Leonard, good evening. So what can we expect to see happen with this budget? Well, good evening, Chris and Mark. The vote was unanimous by council and this 19.7 billion dollar budget was definitely more lean this year. But despite the economic uncertainty, council members have voted to approve spending on education, housing and social safety net programs. The mayor, given tough financial times, has called for cuts in the budget, but council still wants to fund certain priorities for D.C. residents. Members want $23.9 million in additional funding for D.C. public schools and $15 million for charter schools. $35 million will go toward emergency rental assistance funding and $40 million for 230 permanent housing vouchers over several years. But much of Tuesday's hearing centered on several council amendments that included more funding for things like rec centers in a city that has shut several. Here is Councilman Trayon White. At the council, we often talk about a conversation around equity, uh, and I believe that the budget is a more documented where we should put our money, where our, where our heart is and where our priorities are. And in getting the budget from the mayor, that has been a challenge for all council members to try to figure out where we put money. But this is an opportunity for those members on the council to just not just talk about equity, but put our money into areas that need it the most. Now, the, the council's budget goes to the mayor for either her veto or her approval. And as you know, the mayor has called for an austere budget, so we don't know how she will rule or how she will vote uh, or approve or disapprove of this uh, budget, these budget changes by council. Reporting from the Wilson Building, Leonard N. Fleming, DC News Now, back to you.